Hey everybody, how is it going? Welcome back. So in my previous video where I was showing you all the new features of Android 10 and One UI 2 on the Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus, I actually told you that Bluetooth Dual Audio was removed from this update. Well, the thing is that is not true. I was wrong. Bluetooth Dual Audio is still there on One UI 2. It has been relocated to a different location on the phone. So the thing is, if a geek like me can get confused, I'd imagine a lot of people will be complaining that Bluetooth Dual Audio has been removed. So in this video, I will show you how to enable Bluetooth Dual Audio on Samsung phones running Android 10 with One UI 2. By the way, I will be demonstrating on the Galaxy Note 9. It's the exact same procedure on all Samsung phones running Android 10. Alright, so the first thing you'll need to do is connect two different Bluetooth speakers or Bluetooth headphones or a speaker or a headphone, doesn't really matter. And I already have this Xiaomi Pocket Speaker 2 connected. So we will be connecting this Sony speaker. So first let's turn the Sony speaker on. Let's go to Bluetooth settings and let's connect. So these two are already paired. If the speaker is not paired, you will need to pair it with your Samsung phone. So it says here connected for calls and audio and the Pocket Speaker 2 also says connected for calls and audio. If one says connected for calls and audio and the second one says connected for audio, then also it will work no problem. So now let us launch the music player and I will play a song. So only the Sony speaker is playing music right now. There is no music coming out of this. See no music. But drop down the notification panel and tap on media. So tap over here and this will take you to this screen. So this is where you can enable Bluetooth dual audio. So if you press over here. So now music is playing back on both of these speakers. And both of these speakers have separate volume control. So check this out. So this one is also playing. So this one. So this is awesome. Bluetooth dual audio is still there on Android 10. It's just in a different location. And the reason why I got confused is because it was not there under Bluetooth. Previously you would find Bluetooth dual audio here and it was also not under sound and vibration. So it is in a completely different location under media. And like I said, the volume control is separate for both of these speakers. So yeah, Bluetooth Dual Audio is a fantastic feature if you and your friend want to listen to the same song at the same time. You can do that with this little feature called Bluetooth Dual Audio. And I am extremely sorry about the confusion. I think I should have done a little bit more research before posting that video. Another feature that I think many of you guys don't know is separate app sound. So picture this, you are at a party and you are streaming music from your phone to a Bluetooth speaker. And someone comes up to you and asks you to play a YouTube video. Or you might want to show your own YouTube video to someone. But if you play a YouTube video, the music streaming stops and that will interrupt your party. So check this out. There's a feature called separate sound that will allow you to stream music from your music player uninterrupted to the Bluetooth speaker and you can still play YouTube video and the sound from the YouTube app will play on the phone. So that is separate app sound. So go to settings and then tap on sounds and vibration. Scroll down and then tap on separate app sound and turn this feature on. So first thing you'll need to do is select an app. So tap over here and select Samsung Music or whichever music player you want to use. So the app that you select over here will play music onto the Bluetooth device. So Samsung Music will stream music to the Bluetooth speaker. And then under audio device, make sure that you select the Bluetooth device. And that is all you need to do. Now, if you get a prompt over here, just tap on OK, but we don't seem to get any prompt. So first time when you set this feature up, you will get a prompt. Just tap on OK and that and then you are pretty much good to go. So now I'm going to play music in the music player. And launch the YouTube app. So check this out. 
the sound from the YouTube app is actually playing back on the phone, but the music player is still streaming music uninterrupted to the Bluetooth speaker. So, and you can control the volume level of the Bluetooth speaker on the speaker itself. So that was Bluetooth dual audio and separate app sound on the Samsung Galaxy Note 9. The S9 Plus running Android 10 and One UI 2 also has this and the newer phones also have this feature. So I think that brings us to the end of this video. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for more videos like these and I will see you guys next time.